What's up guys, Tony from Tony Teaches Tech here. In this video, I'm gonna see how quickly we can get set up from scratch with a Bolter WordPress server instance. Let's start the clock right now. All right, so I'm here in my Bolter dashboard. Let's click on deploy a new server here. We want a cloud compute server in New Jersey. The application that we want is WordPress, which is right down here at the bottom. Let's go with the cheapest plan, $5 a month, and nothing else is fine. So click on deploy now and you'll see here that it's installing and while it's installing let's get a terminal window up here so we can get ready to ssh in and see what's going on after that happens so um, when when this actually finishes installing we'll get an ip address we'll get a username for which is typically root and a password so that way we can SSH in, see what's going on on that end, like the Apache side of things, and then also check the um, the GUI end of it. So like go to the IP address and see if WordPress is installed at that IP address. So it's still installing here as you can see. Um, when this finishes, we'll go ahead and start all that. Oh, we actually do have an IP address. I was wrong. So. I'm, I'm guessing if you go to this right now, you won't see anything. It's just going to be like, you know, an error page or something from Google Chrome or just sit there for a while um, because it's still installing. It's probably loading Apache, PHP, all those things. And uh, yeah, so while while it's doing that, um, if you're not familiar, Volter is a cloud VPS web hosting provider. Uh, they're known for how cheap they are and how quick you can get set up with a instance like you saw on the previous page you can do um, Ubuntu Debian uh, you can do like a Windows server any lots of flavors of Linux and uh, there's these applications that you can pre-install like a, a LAMP server uh, um, WordPress in this case okay so we're running enough talking let's see if the IP resolves to anything which it doesn't seem like it is but uh, while that's still loading up here we'll keep an eye on that we can click on manage and go to this IP address so we can do root ssh root at this IP address and copy the password uh, yes that's okay we can keep going type in paste and we're in so we're into the server the server is existing right here it's asking us for um, these credentials so uh, without explaining it because the clock's running oops we want type username in here and the password and sure we can say there we go so we got the wordpress installation happening the site title my test site username admin password that's fine i know it's weak password email tony at tony teaches tech and install wordpress what was i saying um login can't say it yet because the clock's still running admin password and we are in there's our there's our uh, WordPress website, here it comes. There we go, so we can stop the clock officially. Um, from start to finish, it looks like less than four minutes to do that, so that, um, if you watch my other video on Linode and my other video on DigitalOcean, uh, which I'll link as necessary above and below, um, this is by far the quickest way to get set up with a WordPress instance using like one of these cloud VPS service providers. Um, what was I saying? I wanna go back to this, okay, so, there is this extra layer of security, and I really like this, and this is kind of off topic, but I really like this whole section here that Volter gives you by default with um, this extra layer of security that they have for people accessing the WordPress admin dashboard. You have to, it's like um, an Apache level security. As you can see, you have to type in, well, you had to type in the username and the password to even get to the WordPress admin dashboard. So that's what this extra piece, these username and password, these credentials are for. Um, they tell you how to set up your DNS. Um, they have this cool thing called cockpit, which is for managing your, where is it? For managing your, um, your server from a web browser. So that's really cool. And yeah, so, uh, that's, this is like the, the speed from 
whatever whatever you want to say like inception from idea to having a wordpress website by far volter wins that battle it is the quickest um, and it's super cheap too it's actually comparable to DigitalOcean and, and linode but um, but it's cheap compared to like a dedicated server or shared hosting in many cases so so yeah that's about it for this video if you guys like this video give it a thumbs up if you really liked it subscribe to my channel and if you do, I'll see you in the next one.